welcome to career guidance max playlist in this video i'm going to give overview of the paper matrices and calculus so what are all the topics are important in unit wise how to pass in matrices and calculus uh, the suggestion i'm giving only for uh, those who want to just pass so keep it in your mind in unit 1 already you know that matrices in that matrices if you know eigen values and eigen vector that means uh, in this section you will have four types if you know that concept means you can able to attain uh, one 8 mark or you can able to attain one 16 mark based on the reduction of a quadratic form to canonical form in this section definitely you will get one 16 mark uh, so you can practice more on this uh, otherwise i don't know how to find eigen vector how to write quadratic equation converting to canonical form i don't know all those things sir so based on this 100 percent you will get one question either 8 mark or 16 mark okay so or uh, you can uh, study kayla hamilton theorem if you know kayla hamilton theorem means easily we can get one eight mark but this kayla hamilton theorem takes so much of time this is normal procedure we are multiplying the 3 by 3 matrix or adding and subtracting or squaring multiple levels of steps we have to apply while doing the problem in Kelly Hamilton theorem. My suggestion is first two you can complete. Worst case you will get one eight or uh, definitely you will get one sixteen mark. Matt says there is no chance you have to score a minimum sixteen mark. There otherwise no chance. If you are not attending matrix problem means you cannot be able to pass in uh, matrices and calculus model paper okay based on university see this unit 2 unit 2 is differential calculus i'm not going to explain much more on this here you should know only the one thing absolute and local maximum minima of one variable model in this unit last section application of maximum and minima if you know this means you can get easily one eight more remaining all will be depend upon your mindset if you want to able to study means you can study continuous limit derivatives maybe you may get one uh, eight more from that but under percent you will get one eight more from this section so 16 plus 8 now the cumulative is 24 okay and uh, third unit functions of several variable in this also love lot of topics but i'm saying first you can study in this unit taylor series because in this taylor series 100 percent you will get one eight mark and the maxima and minima for two variable in unit two you will have one variable but here two variable from this half of the chance for one eight mark or here you will have one more topic lacrange's from this both you will get one eight mark definitely okay method and uh, Jacobian sometimes they may ask not completely maybe 25 percent chances are there one eight mark so in this third unit you can prepare for uh, one eight mark if you know these three section uh, definitely you will get one eight mark maybe your luck you may get one sixteen mark also I'll take only one eight mark already the cumulative up to two unit is 24 now you can add one more uh, 8 Taylor series under percent you will get one question so practice more on this 24 plus 8 now you will get 32 when you are writing unit 1 2 3 you will get how much mark per how many marks 32 marks and the next C unit 4 in this unit 4 we cannot able to predict the problems for why because uh, <coughs> If you doesn't understand the basic integral calculus, you cannot be able to solve the problem. Very few topics only, maybe the chances are there. Trigonometric substitution, they are asking repeatedly, but uh, different manner they are asking. If you are able to understand trigonometric substitution method, you may get one eight mark or reduction, this three form. Here you will have cosecant, secant, uh, cot also. According to that, uh, you will get one reduction form, one eight mark and partial fraction one eight mark 
So overall in this unit, if you understand these concepts now, you can be able to, the very basic concepts also they are integration by parts, may, sometimes they may ask in integration by parts also, that are all basic, in every basic problem you can uh, try to solve, but these topics are important. Uh, you can, uh, worst case, you, you may get one 8 mark means 32 plus, 32 plus 8, 32 up to 3 unit, in this unit 8, you will get 40, right off. And the next, in this paper, last unit multiple integral. Here, uh, I am suggesting only you can study these two, volume and change of order of integration. Uh, I am not uh, putting the videos from volume, I put in unit 5, I uploaded only the section change of order of integration, okay. You just refer that and uh, you can study volume also. You will get definitely one 8 mark from this or sometimes they may ask in 16 mark. Change of order of integration, 100 percent you will get one 8 mark. If you understand the concept is minimum you will get 4 or 5. And uh, basic problems in triple integral, how to apply triple integral, all those things. So, 40 plus 8, 48, right? Uh? So, finally, suppose you are making some mistakes while doing the problem means, out of this 48 minimum you may get, uh, definitely you will get 40 mark. So you have scored 40 now, minimum uh, you can be able to attend at least one 3 or 4, uh, 2 marks also. So from that you will get, uh, for example you can take 6 mark from 2 mark now, 46. So around you will get uh, 50, definitely you will be passing matrices and calculus. So follow this sections unit wise and prepare accordingly you will get a good mark if you know these sections now definitely you will get more than 70 also sometimes or worst case definitely you will get pass if you doesn't studying this topic means definitely you won't get the pass okay so if you want to pass the unit one is very very important unit one is uh, helping for you for getting 16 mark that is matrix only, you can practice more on matrix problem, okay. If you get the marks in unit 1 means, 16 mark means, definitely you can say I will be pass. So this is the procedure you have to follow while studying the matrices and calculus. So finally I have to say, end of this course, uh, we will give the all important topics, videos, descriptions in this uh, final video. You just go through that and uh, get a good mark, okay. So, in a short span, we uploaded only the important topics unit wise. We are not uploading uh, all the topics, okay. So, what are all the topics here uh, explained? Everything we have in a video format. You just go through that. Any doubt, you can uh, comment me.